wants you to reign. Christ is our redemption. God is righteous in making the sinner righteous. Coming up on Destined to Reign. This is the Bible. This is the Word of God Himself, which is a, a word that cannot be broken, the Bible says. God's promise He will save you out of all your troubles, whether you're discontented, in debt, in distress. Today with Joseph Prince. Praise the name of Jesus. You all ready for the Word? Yes. How many of you have been experiencing open doors already, even last year? Closed doors, open doors. Remember this. The theme for this year is the key of David. Revelations chapter 3. Look up here on the screen. Revelations chapter 3. And to the angel of the church in Philadelphia write, This thing says he who is holy, he who is true, he who has the key of David, he who opens and no one shuts, and shuts and no one opens. Now remember this, remember this. The name David is mentioned here, the key of David. In Isaiah 22, 22, it says here, look up here, and I will lay upon him, or put on his shoulder, the key of the house of David. Notice the phrase, the key of the house of David. The key of the house of David. House of David. What is the house of David? In Zechariah chapter 12, verse 10, it tells us a promise that God says, and I'll pour on the house of David and on the inhabitants of Jerusalem the spirit of grace and supplication. The spirit of grace and supplication is one and the same. Spirit of grace and supplication. Supplication is what you bring before God. When you experience grace, all right, it translates into prayer to God and praise to God, worship to God. The word thanksgiving, all right, is actually the word or praise, thanksgiving, is the word eucharist, eucharist in Greek, which means charis is there. The word charis is Greek for favor, for grace. Amen. When you give